The Bantam Tools milling machine software includes probing routines that allow you to locate stock in the machine, create work offsets, locate a bracket, and also manually position the spindle to zero out the machine along a particular axis. In the Bantam Tools software, users set both the position of the stock in the machine as well as the position of the file in the machine. This is done in order to create an accurate preview of the job. Let's review how these positions relate to one another. The machine bed origin is the top left corner of the bed. The material is relative to this machine bed origin, and the plan position is relative to the top left corner of the material. There are three buckets of probing routines, material location routines, bracket probing routines, and plan placement probing routines. The majority of the probing routines rely on the conductive nature of the stock and the machine bed. Let's review how these routines work. To locate conductive stock in the machine, you'll want to launch the automatic material location routine. Jog the probe over the left corner of the stock and hit start. You can begin this routine as far as an inch inside from the material edge. Note that the probe will never travel further in X or Y positive from where you begin. To locate non-conductive material in the bed, you can use the manual stock location tool. Use the jog wheel to slowly bring the spindle to the part edge and then select which side of the tool you're using to probe. Alternatively, when working with non-conductive materials, you can remove the L-bracket and reorient it along the front edge of the bed, and then launch the L-bracket probing routine. Jog the spindle to the inside corner below the top edge of the bracket and hit start. This is a helpful setup for non-conductive materials, but also for jobs that will be repeated over and over, as you'll only need to probe the bracket once. Note that the material location routines and the bracket location routines are either or. It's not intended that you do both of these. Plan placement probing routines allow you to offset your plan relative to the material. By default, plans are automatically aligned to the top left corner of the stock when imported to the software. Setting your work coordinate system in your CAM program to reflect this means that you'll only need to run the material location routine and you'll have an accurate preview and your plan oriented correctly. When machining in more than one operation or to align your plan along a different edge or feature, launch one of the plan placement routines. Let's look at how these work. Single axis probing is a kind of semi-automatic way to locate an edge. Jog the spindle within an inch of the edge you wish to probe, click the corresponding probe button, and the probe will stop once it makes contact. Click the corresponding set zero button and your plan will update to that edge. This can be useful for quickly adjusting the Z height of your file for engravings or when iterating on a design. Manual plan positioning is identical to the manual stock location tool and requires you to jog the spindle into place and again zero out a plan at a desired location for each axis. The advanced probing routines rely on the same core functions as the single axis probing, but require fewer steps. For the outer rectangular routine, you'll select the corner you wish to probe from the pop-up menu, jog the spindle over that corner, and hit start. The boss and bore routines will return the center point of either feature. For the boss routine, you'll want to begin with the probe at a rough center point over the circular boss. For the bore routine, you'll want to begin with the probe inside the bore at the rough center point. It's also important to note that the plan placement probing routines won't update your material placement in the Bantam Tools software. These routines only update the plan placement relative to the material. If you've adjusted your stock for a new operation, you'll need to reprobe the stock using the material probing routines and then run your plan placement probing routine to ensure the software's preview displays properly. And there you have it. There are three important things to remember. The material location is relative to the bed, and the plan location is relative to the material. By default, plans align themselves to the top left corner of the material, and setting your work coordinate system in your CAM software to the top left corner of your stock is a good general practice for one operation parts to save yourself an extra step. All right, happy milling.